So, seeing things seem to be unraveling at a pretty quick pace now. Um, and something happened into my radar the last couple days. And I'm making this video not to hurt anybody and not to... We're all human. We're all fallible. We all make mistakes. Um, if a person puts themselves up as a hero or savior and they come up short, fine. You know, it's nothing on them. But as we go forward, we need to really be careful with who we appreciate, I think. And I know there are a lot of conservative people who may happen upon this channel. Um, and they probably have a new superhero named Charlie Kirk. But I don't think he's who he says he is. So it's just quick. Um, I probably shouldn't be doing this, but whatever. So she's got a cool little website, Charlie Kirk website. And he's got a MAGA Doctrine book. Yeah, everybody wants to make America great, except for the Native Americans who are here first. But that's another video. Charlie Kirk biography, net worth and salary. This is interesting. 78,000 to 443,000 to 2 million to 4 million to 8 million. So double, double, double. Which is great. Good. Make a lot of money. But did you do it authentically and because of your own talents? Or were you put up there to steer and guide society? I'd wager that's probably it. Um, nothing really interesting in his bio, I don't think. He probably speaks pretty good. He's, he had a culture war thing at Grand Canyon University, which is probably one of those fake universities that you have to pay for and you don't get anything out of. Um, he thinks Trump has improved the lives of black Americans. I don't think anyone's improved the lives of black Americans personally, but that's just my own editorial opinion. Other than black people themselves, individuals improve their lives. Government never makes anybody's life better. And if you believe they do, check again, please. Um, oh, Westward, ad blocker. They were up at CSU in Colorado. So I, I can't show you that because I use an ad blocker. And I'm not going to disable it. So, um, But here's what caught me. Let's take a real quick watch. Uh, my question is for Charlie. Um, Charlie, uh, I wanted to ask you about you trying to, to get into West Point. You... Uh, you said that you applied to West Point, but they gave your place to an applicant of a different gender and persuasion. I know the test scores, and I knew the qualifications. She was less qualified. So my question is, uh, if they were of different gender, do you know what gender they were? I never said that. That's fake news. Thanks for being here tonight. Never said that. Thank you for being there tonight. I eventually lost my spot out to what I felt was a far less qualified applicant uh, in my district that was of a, you know, a different gender and a different, you know, persuasion. You could take it any way you want, but I, I knew the test scores, I knew the qualifications, I was kind of got the short end of the stick. <laughs> he never said it yet. He said it and it's on video. Don't say stuff if you don't mean it, Mr. Kirk. Cracking me up over here. All right, anyway, have a good day. Happy Sunday. Thanks. They go over to TMF, TM Films channel and do a little more research on November 3rd. It might be important.